they wanted to have a nice smooth opening to the school year. And you know, knock on wood, I think we've, we've had that. For the first time since March 2020, all Palm Beach County school students returned back to the classrooms. This year, parents had two options, either brick and mortar or full-time Palm Beach virtual. The superintendent says he's still waiting for attendance numbers from across the district. You know, I was like, hoping to have everyone back on campus and it looks like that's the trend and we're happy for it because we really truly believe that's the best place for the students where they're really going to learn both academically and socially emotionally. Students, staff and visitors are required to wear masks. Parents can opt their students out of wearing masks by sending a letter to their child's teacher. One parent I spoke with says he was happy with the opt out option, which wasn't available last school year. He did the mask like he was supposed to. This time around, the option was up in the air with written consent from the parent. I allowed to opt out and allow him to go without a mask if he wanted to. But for other parents who are choosing to mask their child, the opt-out option is concerning. It upsets me because this COVID is serious and I just want things to be right. I want everybody to be healthy. Superintendent Burke says he did see a majority of the students wearing masks and happy to be back in school. We want to make sure we have behavioral professionals on each campus. You know, if there's any needs, we're going to address them. But the kids I've seen have been happy. Uh, most of the kids have been wearing their, their facial covering. The superintendent tells me he will be revisiting the mask policy next month and making modifications as health conditions in the community improve. Reporting live in West Palm Beach, Anna Espinosa to be PBF 25 News.